double digit value. <laughs> Boy, they missed. Is anyone even remember them? Well, I sure do. Terrorists is still. Terrorists is still my number one thing. Hey, surprising enough. Wait, is surprising enough? I mean, to found. Him! This is so I think he's still alive, but you aren't. Nathan? Nathan! Get me to a hospital! <laughs> well, now you can see that it is Return for the Grave, the Mighty Zoids. Oh, except this is not a eighth kind of return. Yeah, the eighth time. As you can see, volume eight, right there. In Japanese! I'm sorry I can't really speak Japanese, but this is the best thing that, um, um, I probably have to go read the kanjis. Uh, let me see. J, J, weird, backward C, upside down Y. So that means it must be awesome! I'm sorry, <laughs> I still don't know how that works. There's some English right there, though. Oh, no, wait, hold on. And content is in English. Yep. Oh, wait a minute. I see what it's now called. It's actually called Poter Trials? Oh, oh no, 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 it's right here. Super Real Action Machine. Zoids. Zoids. And it also says monthly. So, is there graphics? Whatever that is. <laughs> Puterisu. Uh, is that how you spell say the word terrorist in actually, ja actually Japanese? Oh, I know. I don't know. But also, talk. Also, this is. But, but, also, but I still miss the good old days when we used to have these things. The Zoids. Seriously, these things are back in the 2000s and the commercials are awesome. How can we ignore a franchise like this? We need more of them. Or we need to be um, brought back to the United States, considering that they're still using Japan, looks like. But. So, here's the side of the box. And as you can see, it's... Okay, I'm not pronouncing that for the life of me. But you can see the company right there that it belongs Wait, to. monthly? And it's monthly. That's but also, weird. there's a company at the bottom. Tarkaratomi. Tarkaratomi. Tommy. Yeah. But I definitely know what those guys are. Those and guys are responsible for I'm gonna try taking out the barcode so nobody gets that scanning. Yeah. But definitely I know for a fact that Tom that Tommy Corporation is responsible for creating his voice and then pretty much they're brought over by I think it was Hasbro when they brought over to the United States, but I can't remember for the life of me. It was just so weird. And if you ever want to call them, there's their phone number. If I can get it to focus. God damn you camera! This camera's evil! Okay, there we go. So, also, you can, also, you can see that this is a lot better than actually the Zoids that we had back in the 2000s. When Seriously, was this when made? I actually got my terrors, I didn't know I could get it with pretty much extra pieces. Not, also, well, get, it was because of the booklet. Yeah, it comes with the booklet. I didn't know we see a booklet. Or to see with a simple. I didn't see something stupid like this. And this was even badly folded when I first got this cool piece. And yes, as you can see, it's the cool custom parts systems. Yeah, yeah, for a terrorist Harry Bomber. Now, Tommy. Tommy. But yeah, as you can see, it's also by <laughs> Tommy. But yeah, this thing Tommy. is pretty cool. But yeah, this thing is still pretty cool. And as you can see, I saw Roger the... <laughs> Sign it. <laughs> but as you can see, I saw the original terrorist. And all this goriness. Oh, he's you know, far more... Damage I actually thought I could make him. Seriously! I have no idea it was with these toys, but somehow they always seem to break with me. Not that one though. And, it's been, and also things like that one. As you can see, he's missing a tail piece. One of his other pieces is missing. And also, he has three gets three pounds for his feet instead of two. And you know how bad it damages on this thing? Seriously! You can lose it easily. Yeah. Another question. How come these things are so brittle? 
I feel like every time I try to put in a give her like a link. Oh, I should it's Chinese or Japanese. I'm pretty sure it's Japanese because this thing did have an anime at one point. Well, China can have animes. Uh, Japan is actually the country that creates animes. Oh, China creates true. cartoons. True, true, true. Why do you think Japan was China? That's actually more insulting than actually what they ever do. They don't have I forgive myself. <laughs> okay. Okay. So here's the other side. Let's so yeah, it's still the same thing as it was on the other side. But you know, this is a volume 8 thing. And it says it comes with, and also, it also gives us the last date it's from. It is from 2008? Really? Wait a second, hold on. Wait a second, hold on. It says the trademark was made in 1983 and was finished trademarking, or copyright in this case, in 2008. Wait a minute. That means the same thing. It means the second. I'm not sure that I'm going with a hypothetical question, but I think this means that it's now in the public domain. This means that this, which means this toy does not have a coming attached to it anymore. Wait, does that make it real then? Does that mean Bungie's still in there, in in the uh, progress, still with this thing as well? Bungie, really? Bungie cord. <laughs> You do realize the scene does not require a bungee cord. I think I know that. I'm just joking. Alright. Hey, you wanna open it? Eh, sure. Might as well. That's why one of the reasons I brought it. Oh, wait a minute. Hang on. It comes with Velcro and. <gasps> Look at the display on this thing! This is. They awesome. even have a picture. This is even more like better than I thought. This is the best thing I can ever imagine. I think everybody's gonna react because of your reaction to the video. This is really awesome! I mean, seriously, can you imagine that this thing comes with a fold-out system? My terms aren't coming that thing! Seriously, this thing came with a box! Like a smaller box! With none of this stuff! There's like a post box! Postman box! And it has a little bit of Velcro. I guess that's Oh, All that vacuum- va Velcro, I almost called it a vacuum, but this Velcro feels so weird. <laughs> I guess that's why I actually did never sell that much in the United States. True. Or in the fact ever wind up. Even though technically there were electrical versions of these things. Yeah. They should definitely bring them back. I want to see these things as like a trading card series. Or something like that. Or yeah. I'm not sure. I like them to see these things come back. Definitely. I want to see these Zoids come back. They were really awesome. I mean, think about it. It is the ultimate boy, teenage boy's fantasy. Giant humans. Any age. He meant to say any, any age. But yeah, that as well. Any, any gender. Well, anybody did. Look at this picture. <laughs> this is about. I mean, sorry, this series is about people living on a distant planet, controlling giant robotic animals with guns. Certainly, this can make Michael Bay actually for us to be embarrassed of himself with those stupid transformers. No. Definitely so. So yeah, we need. So yeah, now we need to figure out how to open this thing carefully because I want to keep the box together. A bit. True. And we're gonna speed this up very quickly. Ah yes, it's glorious. All the pieces are still here. Hey, Missy these things. Seriously, why? There's the booklet. Yes, the booklet. And all the glorious pieces. That still might also be a little missable by these little pieces here. Uh, that that's person? actually like the tiny figurine that came with it. And that these might are get the lost greatest easily. instructions ever, and I don't know. Oh, how to I read. hate stickers when you have to put them on. They were old school. I remember we had the. I remember the Halo one I have back there somewhere, in that closet. I actually have one that has Halo stuff on it, and it's so hard to put the stickers on. Wait a it's second, Simon, right look at this. Check out this. Seriously, it is reading in look, every I'm single language, except for the fact that it doesn't. That the Japanese is not on the top one, instead of the English one. Well, because they read backwards, don't forget. No! Yeah, uh, yeah! Wait, did they? Yeah, remember? Yeah, but seriously! This is supposed to be... This supposed to be no, don't forget intention. that... I think they originally were made in, in English, and then they translated moved them to Japanese. I do yeah, because this thing came out at the same time as the Transformers, and they're originally from Japan as well. Okay. Especially with those diachrome. Yeah. Die up, Chrome. Like the Chrome browser. <laughs> <laughs> I see this thing works, and look at this thing. It actually gives us a more cool instruction on the entirety of literally Zoids. 
Seriously, it shows us the evolution of this thing, of these systems. It's literally, it shows us like the cool evolutionary factor of this. Entering this room, robot dogs, dogs that got bigger, robot dogs that got bigger, so people drive them, they got bigger, and then we find finally them. Seriously, this is kind of awesome! This thing counts as a trebuchet and a arrow! Do you know what I recommend you try using this Google Translate? Yeah! It's, as you can see, nah. everything, it's everything you can't understand here. I'll understand later. You can just understand by looking at pictures. But like seriously, we, I mean, seriously, I have a question with this thing, though. And th I, I know for a fact I watched the anime. They clearly show they can build these things. They build Zoids. Like a car. And yet somehow, they had this ver this advanced technology back when mankind was still wearing, still have spears and swords. What on earth? What the heck? I have no idea. It even tells us what Zoids eat. That's kind of weird. Apparently it wasn't any bugs to eat each other and some sort of polka dot ball. Maybe that's the Zoid core. Maybe or it could be a power up or something. Or it might it might be the life core that powers all the Zoids. That's why I said you might need Google Translate. Um, yeah, uh, I know. I, or you can just ask someone to comment and see what it actually says. Yep. So let's see what else so we got. So comment down below. You think this is a good toy? It was uh, actually a good one. I already asked that. Oh, wait, but... oh, wait, wait. See, you think, Gax, you know what else we should do? We should also pretty much get the same scan. So that way we so that way we can always have like more of these things. Oh, so that means we really do need this then. No, I mean like scan it on a computer and 3D print the model designs. Yeah, but if they want to get the code, they can do that and then they can order their own. Uh sign, that's not how that thing works. Doll. Oh yeah, they're out of business, so I won't even scan anyway, so. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure they're out of business. I still got this thing like today. Yeah, true. Hey, look at well, all this, Simon. EBay, right? Look at all this. This is a cool factor here. This was Zoids. Seriously. Why? Why? Tell me why. Why on earth did they get rid of this cool, awesome idea? I mean, seriously, look at all these things. They got pterodactyls. Bigger pterodactyls. They got triceratops. They got... I don't know what that thing is. That thing is. Dragosaurus. Let's try to source it. And no, and that's definitely a pretty much a Gastonia with heavy turbine cannons. That's a lot, guys. It looks so freaking awesome. We definitely need Axie Japan to recreate these things. Yeah. And we're going to have part two coming up soon. So we can show you how fast the building went, how long it took. And so we can make this video at least shorter. So check out part two. We'll get back to you as soon as possible. And booyah! I think he's still alive, but you aren't. Nathan? Nathan? Uh... Nathan? 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 Nathan?